let's just do it <clears throat> welcome to your horoscope welcome to your forecast so greetings Aries welcome um, hmm. so you know Chiron is like the asteroid sometimes thought it was a planet or the wounded healer and it's in your first house and and especially if you're an Aries born in um, say like before the 25th of March like the 20th through the 25th you're really getting um, challenged in areas of your own woundedness and healing that and helping others and um, it's been in juxtaposition with Venus now Venus and Libra definitely very very powerful um, Venus is going to do a new dance too this week because I know later on Venus is going to go into the, the actual sidereal zodiac once it hits 24 degrees and um, and that'll happen probably by um, tomorrow so there's this definitely different relationship with Venus now it's going to really intensify for you and for everybody out there um, and so it's in your seventh house, so it's kind of about to go into your eighth, really, in a, in a sense. And so, how are relationships intensifying? That'd be a question as an Aries I would ask this week. Um, going through transformation, a lot of um, refinement to your career, and pushing back at something you thought maybe wouldn't work is going to work. And uh, just accepting the discipline to stay focused, to be that person that gets the job they want and um, just keep paying attention to your spiritual life and um, celebrate your creativity I mean now we're in Virgo time too so like and Mercury's going into Virgo and so we're you know it's like Leo's like this big gigantic party and then Virgo is this um, you know is your sixth house it's your health issues for Aries and it's like the cleanup crew. It's like, okay, here's we got to fix things. Here's where we find all this stuff people left at the party that's a value and we can have. And you know, it's the the cleanup crew. So 